hear that. We must be getting close. Hold on. The TOG-2 is a tier 6 British battleship also known as the HMS Distra. The TOG-2 is a tier 6 British mean tank for fuck's sake. The TOG-2 is a tier 6 premium British heavy tank, and is yet again a perfect example that Britain knows fuck all about designing tanks, since they designed the TOG to breach trench lines just like in World War 1. But then Britain suddenly realized that they were at World War 2 already, so then they decided, fuck it let's slap a cheap turret and a 17 pounder on there and turn it into a world of tanks meme. So because of that this vehicle is most commonly played by shitty casuals who think they are funny because they are driving a meme tank. The hill, focus down and there is the first TOG DEATH. So to be better than them, and to embrace the TOG's carry potential to become the ultimate meme tanker, you should do the following. At first you buy, rammer, improved ventilation, and enhanced gun lane drive. Then for ammo you load mostly AP. Some APC are to counter Japanese enemy tanks, and a little bit HE, to trigger salty tier 6 stat padders. The TOG 2 is officially classed as the slowest vehicle in the entire fucking game. What? You don't believe me? Let's see. Who do you think is going to win this race? A. The TOG 2. Or B. The mouse driving backwards. Now pause the video and enter your vote in the comment section down below. Alright. Here we fucking go. And this is a reason why you should never rely on the TOG speed, since it gets beaten by the fattest tank in the game when it's driving in its fucking reverse gear, so instead, the first thing you should do when you load in the game is double tap your R key and go AFK for around 5 minutes, and by the time you come back, <coughs> and by the time you come back, you should play mostly passively, go stand in a corner and use your enormous amount of hit points to out trade your opponents. But don't get too overconfident with your hit points, and don't drive out in the open without any form of cover, since your armor is just like good matchmaking in World of Tanks, almost non-existent. So therefore RT will be all over your ass, and in combination with regular enemy fire they will drain your hit points even faster than Serb drains your money by selling rigged Christmas boxes. Also going hell down has no benefits, even though the gun depression is as depressing as its top speed you'll still get wrecked, because your turret armor is as shit as the rest of your tank. On the other hand the penetration is very good, so you use this to save money on skill rounds and to maximize your credit income, while you still can feel like a funny fucker, because you're driving a mean tank. To increase your Mei Mei gain, and to become the king of the seas, you should pick the following crew skills. At first train repairs on every crew member. Once 100% drop for. 6th sense on the commander, snapshot on the gunner, smooth ride on the driver, situational awareness on the radio man, safe stowage on the first loader, and adrenaline rush on the second loader, and train repairs again. Once 100% drop for brothers in arms, and surprise surprise train those fucking repairs again. And after that pick whatever floats your boat. This is the correct way on how to play the TOG 2. Now you are officially a living meme. So go out there, and question yourself why the hell you bought this tank in the first place. Jack it up.